see it being the most in-demand job in the uh, or in-demand jobs in the next five years? So it's kind of a fun question, right? Because when I knew you were going to ask me this question, I started to just put some stuff down and think about, okay, where do I see it going just based on what I'm experiencing? And then I kind of did a little Google search, right, and looked at some of the sources that I use for technology. Um, things like artificial intelligence, robots, autonomous driving cars, um, big data, more mobile, digital things. Um, it was funny, I read an article a couple of weeks ago, Apple bought a company called Workflow, which is trying to integrate you know, multitask and multi-app sort of things. So it's going to automate more things that you can do to the point where you can perform tasks on your phone just by pressing a button. So, you know, the Internet of Things, the industrial Internet of Things, the G digital is kind of driving. So it's going to be really neat to see what happens in the next five years. But I think it's going to be a lot of, like, artificial intelligence, the predictive analytics, and then making our lives more integrated into the devices and the things around us. Yeah, there, I, I can definitely agree on a lot of that. Automation is going to be... Uh a huge factor, I think, in the next five years, uh, as far as making a lot of jobs a lot easier. Yep. Um, I'm hoping that, obviously, it doesn't, uh, you know, displace a lot of people, but uh, automation is, oh, God, I love it. We use, we, we try to automate, you know, a lot of tasks, um, you know, at, at the, my job at the hospital that I work at, you know, yeah. whether it's, you know, uh, just really automating our imaging process or, you know, using PowerShell to uh, automate how we, you know, create new user accounts and things like that. So there's so much you could do with automation. So that's one of my big things that I see in the next five years, I think. Well, that's where I think like predictive analytics and how, what we do with all the data that's around us. Um, there's a guy, Sir Tim Berners-Lee, that I don't know if your viewers know some of about what he is, but he's one of the guys that was credited with starting the internet the protocols that did it and he had a quote about data being the next oil and data what data being the next oil oh I so much value in data and what we can do with it so this task get automated how we get smarter how we make people healthier how we make lives easier um start to predict things there was a, a piece i watched on walmart years ago and they talked about they can predict in florida the type of pop tarts to order during hurricane season because they can predict people's buying patterns they can have better real-time inventory when there's the hurricanes. That's crazy. So stuff like that just blows my mind. Of, oh, yeah. That was several years ago. Where are we going to go in the next five years? Yeah. I mean, I, I can remember, this might sound kind of crazy, but even like five years ago or five to seven years ago or something, um, saying I think the next big like kind of wars that we have is going to be a war on data. Like that's mm -hmm. going to be the next war that we have. It's just going to be an all-out war on data. Who can control yeah. the most data, who can have the most data, because that's really what it's, it's coming down to in a lot of as aspects of, uh, I think, the world, you know, is who, who can control the most data and get the yeah. most information, so. Well, and that's why cybersecurity and compliance and risk are such a big hot field. That's a field that's not going to go away anytime soon, in my humble opinion. Yeah, no, I, I always, you know, strongly suggest, uh, you know, security to, yeah. to people who are looking to get, you know, especially more on like the networking side of things and stuff like that too. Yep. You know, security, security, that's, you know, that it, it's kind of like one of those hot topics that, that, you know, people kind of bring up and they kind of like, they don't know how to take it at first, I feel like. And I don't know if you come across that too, but you know, they're like, well, I don't know what, what that is or where that's going to go, but it's, it's not going to go anywhere. It's, it's literally something that's going to have to stick with us for many, many years to come because yeah. it, it's, it's at a, we're at a point right now where, uh, we really need to focus on that. So, yep. being being in that part of the the industry is going to be a a really good thing for a lot of people out there. Yep, totally agree. So, yeah, definitely, that's awesome. That's cool. Thanks.